ready for some wide open spaces? Howdy folks, welcome to episode 173 of the Dorky, Geeky, Nerdy Trivia Podcast. I'm your host Brian Rollins and this week we're strolling through Wyoming. As always, we've got three rounds of ten questions each. If you're new to the show, welcome. You can find rules and scorecards at dorkygeekynerdy.com, along with a bunch of other cool stuff. Looks like the horses are ready, so let's ride. The Dorky Round Number 1. Though it's also in Idaho and Montana, the vast majority of what national park is in Wyoming? Yellowstone National Park. Number two, Wyoming leads the country in mining what fossil fuel? Coal. Number three, what daughter of a U.S. vice president is currently the U.S. representative from Wyoming? Liz Cheney. While not a native Wyomingite, her mother, Lynn, is. Number 4. Ang Lee won a Best Director Oscar for what 2005 Western set in 1960s Wyoming? Brokeback Mountain. The film also won Best Picture, Best Adapted Screenplay, and Best Supporting Actor for Jake Gyllenhaal. Number 5. What painter, born in Wyoming, became famous for his drip method of painting? Jackson Pollock Number six, what two states border Wyoming to the south? Colorado and Utah. Number seven, what Wyoming town is named after Buffalo Bill? Cody, Wyoming. Buffalo Bill's real name was William Frederick Cody. Number 8. What large mammal is on the Wyoming flag? The bison. If you said buffalo, that's incorrect. Bison are native to North America. Buffalo are from Asia and Africa. Number 9. Nearly two-thirds of Wyoming residents own at least one what? A gun. Wyoming has the second highest percentage of gun ownership in the U.S. Number 10. What is the two-letter postal abbreviation for Wyoming? W-Y The Geeky Round Number 1. What is the capital of Wyoming? Cheyenne. Number two, though shot in Calgary, what 1992 Clint Eastwood Western took place in Wyoming? Unforgiven. 
Number three, though not as famous, what national park is located on the southern border of Yellowstone? Grand Tetons National Park. Number four, what two states border Wyoming to the east? South Dakota and Nebraska. Number five, Jim J. Bullock from Casper, Wyoming, played Monroe Ficus on what 80s sitcom for six seasons? Too close for comfort. Number six, Wyoming Governor Nellie Taylor Ross earned what distinction in 1924? She was the first elected female governor in the U.S. She is also Wyoming's only female governor to date and was the director of the U.S. Mint under Franklin Delano Roosevelt. Number seven, what is the official state nickname for Wyoming? The Equality State, so named because it was the first territory in the U.S. to grant women the right to vote. Number eight, how many area codes does Wyoming have? Just one, three, zero, seven. For comparison, Colorado, which is almost the same size, will be adding its fifth area code this year. Number nine, what Western TV show, running from 1959 to 1963 and starring John Smith and Robert Fuller, was named for a Wyoming town? Laramie. Number 10. At 7.6 per 100,000 people, Wyoming leads the nation in what type of fatality? Drunk driving fatalities. The nerdy round. Number 1. What Wyoming town is home to an annual economic symposium and is a location in the horror game The Last of Us? Jackson, Wyoming. Number two, what geological feature was called Big Lodge Butte by the Native Americans? Devil's Tower. Number three, speaking of Devil's Tower, what 1977 film features its finale at the site? Close Encounters of the Third Kind. Number four, what young man's beating, torture, and death outside of Laramie, Wyoming in 1998 raised awareness about hate crimes about LGBTQ persons? Matthew Shepard Number 5. What 1902 novel by Owen Wister set in Wyoming has been adapted into five movies and a 249-episode TV series.
The Virginian. The first adaptation was directed by Cecil B. DeMille. Number 6. In terms of population, where does Wyoming rank in the U.S.? Fiftieth, or last. According to the latest estimate, Wyoming has a little over half a million people in it. Number 7. Anne Gorsuch Burford from Casper was the first female head of what federal agency? The Environmental Protection Agency, or EPA. If her name sounds familiar, that's because her son, Neil Gorsuch, is a Supreme Court Justice. Number 8. What department store first opened in Kemmerer, Wyoming, in 1902? <laughs> J.C. Penny. Number 9. What animal, native to Wyoming, is the fastest land animal in the Western Hemisphere? The pronghorn antelope. It can top out at 60 miles per hour. Number 10. Where would you find the Bronco Old Steamboat? The horse, along with its rider, is on every Wyoming license plate. Put the horses back in the stable because we are done. Everyone had a good time? I hope so. Wyoming is not too far from where I live, and I've spent a lot of time there. Most of it in Yellowstone and Grand Tetons National Park. If you haven't visited Wyoming, I highly recommend it. We've given them some grief about how few people live there, but honestly, that's part of the state's charm. It's big, beautiful, and quiet. Here are a few bonus facts about Wyoming. It's the 44th state, having joined the Union in 1890. It's the 10th largest state, with 97,814 square miles. The highest point in Wyoming is Gannett Peak at 13,809 feet. That's 9,000 feet taller than last week's state, West Virginia, also known as the Mountain State. We'll be back again next week with 30 more trivia questions about another U.S. state. Here's your clue for next week. What is the only U.S. state to grow tea? I'm a big tea drinker, so this was a cool fact for me to learn. I'll see you back here next Wednesday. This has been episode 173 of the Dorky, Geeky, Nerdy Trivia Podcast. Show notes and transcripts can be found at dorkygeekynerdy.com. The music has been by Jason Shaw at audionautics.com. I'm your host, Brian Rollins. You can find me at thevoicesinmyhead.com. And thanks for listening.